Now, the Moon Jae-in administration today launched a special committee that will be in charge of accepting the public's ideas and suggestions for government policies over the next 100 days. This was one of President Moon's key pledges during his campaign. Our Ji myung has the details. The Korean public took center stage at the launching ceremony on Thursday of President Moon Jae-in's special transition team which will run for 100 days and focus on gathering and implementing the views of the people in future policies of Moon's five-year term. In order for this Kwangha Moon First Avenue to succeed, we need the active participation of our citizens. President Moon has stressed the need to have the public contribute in the setting of the direction and goals of the new government. Therefore, any Korean citizen can submit their policy proposals to the so-called People's Transition Committee. Here at Sejongno Park, next to Kwangha Square in Central Seoul, citizens can come and register their own policy proposals. They can also be submitted at the committee's website by post or by email. The committee's temporary plaza at Sejongno Park will run until early July every day, except Mondays. Let's hear what the citizens think. I hope the many policies suggested and submitted by us will be well implemented while running state affairs. I think this is a novel event, and it shows the president's strong will to vastly communicate with the people. The committee will spend the first 50 days accepting and sorting out policy suggestions by the general public, while the remaining 50 days will be spent on reviewing possible ways to implement feasible proposals. By the time the People's Transition Committee nears its 100th day, officials plan to report the committee's assessments and results by holding a town hall meeting to allow sincere and direct talks between President Moon and the public. Kim Young-gil, Arirang News.